Hey guys, it's Ben here today, and I'm showing you the story time about time. Wait, this is literally just the craziest story time about the craziest brawl I've ever seen. So this takes place um July of this year, and right after, after I turned 18 and shit. We um we actually had like a fight night, like like a charity event or something, like a donation event, and then like. There was like fight night and shit like that. So there was what like say about ten fights the whole night. So yeah um we set I started setting up, we set up all like the activism and all that shit. We set up and then um <coughs> um, um yeah we set up and then Yeah, so we finished setting up for the fucking fights and shit. Yeah, shit. So yeah, after we're done setting up for the fights and shit. So yeah, after we're done setting up the fights and shit, we we watch a couple of them. Literally, it's like halfway through where the brawl starts to happen. So, this uh, one of the fighters he got mad because he didn't have a fight, he didn't like have an actual fight. So, <laughs> literally, he was being so stupid that he walked, ran onto the fuck, he can went on the fucking octagon ring or something. The ring, yeah, I don't even know what the fuck it was, but he went on the ring. And then he proceeds to <coughs> fucking one hit the fucking, um, uh, damn it, I don't know what to call it. It was like this dude that ran the thing, like the, the person who runs it. He knocks, he, he hits him with a one, with a one two, and he knocks his ass out. And he begins starting to beat the absolute fuck out of him, right? And then fighters are getting in there trying to stop him they stop him and then shit escalates all the way over to the other to the other room so there's well like 50 60 people <clears throat> over there just fucking fighting and shit they literally it was what how many people were there fighting um all the fighters were in there spectators were in there hell even i had to get in there like there's like, just so many people that got in there so yeah after that happened there was like a huge brawl and then the, literally this happened at like the academy like my wrestling academy like they like hold this like fight night every year so yeah there's a huge brawl and then like all that shit and my coach was like trying to like break everybody up so <clears throat> yeah they, he broke everyone up and then yeah, he was literally warning everybody because there was just, like, one trophy in the back. Like, where you could literally seriously cut yourself. It was that sharp where you could cut yourself. So, yeah, he's warning the, co the coach. He was, like, warning everybody about it. And then, like, everybody, like, there was, like, a couple people that, like, called the cops and shit. So, yeah, they call the cops. The cops come within, like, what, 10, 15 minutes? They, no, it was actually, like, 5, 10 minutes, actually, they were there. I call the cops, um, so yeah, <clears throat> they, they asked someone, they asked people about the fight, and then, like, what happened, so yeah, and then, they explained it from start to finish, and then they're just like, <clears throat> okay, can we talk to the people that were fighting, and they do that, and I could do that, and so yeah. He was, um, <clears throat> Dude fighting actually got arrested. <laughs> actually, which is kind of funny. And plus, we literally found out like a couple days later that he was, he was like he had a warrant for like two felonies and shit <clears throat> that that were somehow. So yeah, <laughs> yeah, he's getting charged. See ya, guys. That's the start time about. Crazy sprawl I've ever...
And so now that's it for now. Make sure to kind of like subscribe, turn on post bell notifications, and that's it for now. Peace out.